Hi guys, it's me. Welcome back to my channel. So today is the next day of my previous video, um, which I hope you all saw and appreciated and liked. And as promised, I'm going to continue filming and I hope, I hope fingers crossed to be consistent. And um, yeah, so today's going to be a beach day. It's so warm. It's so hot. Not warm, it's hot. And um, yeah. And then tomorrow's gonna be a cinema day. We're gonna see Oppenheimer and we're going to the mall. Uh, so I thought, you know what, let's just stretch the vlog for a couple of days and bring you guys with me. So I thought of checking in before going to the beats. Uh, I'm wearing my swimsuit, the huge from Hansa G. So that's that. And I just wanna show you guys a little bit of bits that I bought uh, the past few weeks. Um, so the main thing is this little agenda. Um, you see, here's the thing. Isn't she super, super cute? And it's from this Italian brand called Legami Milano, which sells the cutest, cutest things. Um, here's the thing. I've always had an agenda, but for the past few years, I want to say I rely on the uh, calendar on my iPhone whatever appointments or things I have to remember. It's not so much appointments because I'm not, I'm not that busy of a girl. But things that I need to remember, especially work-related, I write on, my, on the calendar of my iPhone so that I remember and um, it's there. But I thought, you know, I want to slowly switch back to like regular paper, solid agenda. Because it reminds me so much of the school days, you know, when we went to school, having a diary was like life. And you put my I put everything in there, write everything, and I would use it every, every day. So, yeah, I thought I would like to go back to that cold concept of having a diary slash agenda, writing, mainly because I would like to start, you know, I feel that nowadays in this era of technology and computer, we kind of write, I, me personally, I don't write as much. And I like writing. Uh, so I thought, let's just, I saw, okay, mainly I saw this and I fell in love. So I thought, let's just, you know, try. And we'll see, we'll see how it goes. I haven't started it yet because it starts from September 1st. And here's the thing, I don't know if I should do like a day by day, like, you know, it starts from se September 1st, so I should, you know, start writing from September 1st. Or don't even bother about the days and just write whatever, whenever, uh, regardless of what, it, of what day it is. So, I don't know, what do you think? Are you a person who writes on a diary? You have an agenda? Do you, you know, do it on a daily basis or you just write whenever you feel like it? Just let me know. Anyway, this is super cute. It is super cute and it's tiny and you know, you could carry it, you could carry it in your bag if you want to. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that this is something that makes me so happy. Just looking at it makes me so happy. Look at that. Can you see? It's a unicorn pen which shines. I love it. I saw it and I went, oh, I have to have it. So yeah, it's actually a pen, but uh, the pen is lousy. It writes, I write terribly with this pen, but I don't care because uh, it's just so cute. I have it on my writing desk and it makes me happy. Just like the agenda it makes me happy every time I look at it. So I just keep it and it's so cute. Oh my God. Yeah, I know. I know what to do. So that's all the stationary stuff. Now let's go to a little bit of makeup. I bought a couple of um, lippies that I wanted to show you guys. I got this one from Summer Fridays because everybody's going crazy about this, like on, uh, especially on TikTok, on Instagram, everybody has this from Summer Fridays. Uh, butter balm, lip butter balm, and I got it in the color pink sugar. I definitely understand the hype. It's really, really nice. You know what? I'm going to put some on it. Mm. It's very nice, and the reason why I like it so much is because it's not sticky. It's not sticky at all. It's very, very comfortable on the lips. So, yes, it's approved by me. I like it. And then I also got these two uh, lippies from MAC. These are those infamous, I mean, it, it went viral on TikTok, and the technical name is Plumping Gloss Stick. Yeah. 
basically it's one of those that plumps so you get that mental that mental kind of uh, feeling on your lips which I really really love and it's a gloss in a stylo stick form so when you put it on be aware do not um, twist it up too much make sure it's just you know leveled to the stick because otherwise it will just break on your lips it's, it's very soft because it's basically gloss it's all gloss it's super 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 soft and uh, squishy but I use it I use I use it on its own but mainly on top of other lipsticks just to get that glossy effect and I like it I mean is it groundbreaking no but I like it and I got it in black because actually this was the only one I wanted to get but then the uh, essay at the MAC counter said, you know what, are you sure you don't want a black one? Because I only have one left and uh, everybody uh, that came here wanted the black one. So, you know, I only have one left. You sure you don't want it? And obviously, if you say that, I will say, yes, yes, give me the black one too. So, yes. And she recommended to put the black one on top of red lipsticks. So, I am all about the red lip. So, I obviously had to get it. So, that's that. That's a little bit of an update check-in that I wanted to do with you guys. And now we can go to the beach. We're going to go and um, have something to eat as well because it's currently 11. So by the time we get there, put everything under the umbrella, we get something to eat. And then I, oh, I'll, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys my whole routine when I go to the beach. So I will see you guys later. Okay guys, so I'm basically filming and I have no idea what I'm filming because the sun is so strong. Anyway, this is our umbrella. This is our, as the Italians say, stabilimento. This is our stabilimento where we go called Lido Serenella. This is our umbrella and obviously in my case we have this like boardwalk for the wheelchair. So easy breezy and I have all the space under our umbrella. And let me just show you the beach. So yeah, that's this other boardwalk, which allows me to arrive close to the water, almost, almost. Anyway, there's always a beautiful breeze the closer you get to the water. And this is it. This is it. This is where I spend my summer days. Or at least now that I'm on leave, I hope to come to the beach almost every day. And yeah, oh, it feels so nice to be here. And uh, yeah, so this is actually like the third week of August. So there isn't, it isn't like super, super busy, full of people. Uh, last week, which was Ferragosto, uh, August 15th here in Italy is like public holiday and we celebrate like the, uh, like summer. So in Italy, almost everything shuts down. And last week it was buzzing with people. But this week, I want to say many people got back to work and stuff like that. So we are, you know, there's a more, more relaxed vibe going on. And I appreciate that very, very much. So, yeah, that's that. Okay, so I hope you can see me. I can't see anything, okay, with this glare. Anyway, it is currently 12.30. Ciao! 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 No, no, no. Yeah, so that was my maths teacher from middle school. <laughs> you know, this is the village life. When you live in a small town, everybody knows everybody. Actually, I haven't seen her in years. And um, yeah, I didn't know that she comes, like her daughter comes here at this stabilimento sometimes in the summertime anyway so yeah as I was saying it is 12 30 and we're gonna chillax for a while until one more or less and then we're going to have something to eat so yeah I might FaceTime my auntie just to kill some time and I will check in with you guys later off to lunch 
però abbiamo. Ciao, buongiorno. Ciao, buongiorno. Ciao. Hai un tavolo per due? Siamo un tavolo libero per due. the light guys this is an Italian summer life in a small town by the beach so much for having a light lunch, <laughs> hi guys so we are back under the umbrella we just had lunch I have to say I'm not that full I mean I ate I'm happy about my lunch it was a very good lunch and usually like in the afternoon around 4.30, 4, 4.30, 5 o'clock, we go and have gelato. But unfortunately, and the gelato place is like right in front of me right now, it's just across the road and it's there. But today's Tuesday and they're closed. I mean, it's, it's very, very shocking, okay? And it disturbs me deeply because I don't understand why you would close your store, uh, shop, cafe, whatever, in the middle of the week. So, yeah. In fact, my brother texted me and said, I'll reach you guys for gelato later. I'm like, what? what? What are you even talking about? They're closed today. So, yeah, it's a pity because I wanted to show you guys the all the gelato flavors. It's just so... Mm, it makes my mouth water just talking about it. Anyway, no gelato today. But I'll show you guys another, di another time. Uh, and, yeah, so it's currently 2.30. And usually now I just stay in the shade under the umbrella and I read. And um, I put on, even though I'm in the shade, I put on my um, SPF. And this is the one that I've been using for years. It's by Hawaiian Tropic and it's a spray dry oil. SPF 30. I love it so much. I love it because, first of all, it's spray. So it's so easy to apply and fast. And it's also an oil. So, you know, it definitely helps with the tanning. So, yes, that's that. I just wanted to show you guys. I get it from Amazon. Now, we will spend at least an hour and a half, an hour and a half reading my book. As I said, I'm reading The Covenant of Water. And I will catch up with you guys later. Bye-bye. Hi guys, so here we are at Zara and I'm very glad to see that the autumn collection has come out. I wanted to give, show you guys my outfit of the day, if you can see. So I'm wearing this um, dress from Walford. It's actually the collaboration between Walford and Amina Mwadi from a couple of years ago, I want to say. Uh, love it, love it. Definitely a staple of mine in the summer season. Then I'm wearing my Loewe bag that I showed you guys in my previous video and my Adidas slippers. So very comfortable, a comfortable look and later we are going to the movies. So sort of, you know, coming a little early and going around the mall. There's actually one thing I want to check out in Zara which is a um, uh, gilet. I wanted to get a gilet because uh, it seems to be very popular. So, yeah, why not? Why not? Let's see. Right, so here's one actually just at the entrance. I don't know. I mean, for 30 euros, I might just give it a try. What do you think? Right, so in Italy, when you go to the bar, which is like the cafe in Italy, I always take ginseng, which is... Um, I don't even know how to explain, but for the Italian girls out there, you know exactly what I'm talking about. My favorite coffee, which is not even coffee. Hi guys, here I am. So, welcome back to this last segment 
of the vlog. I think I'm gonna end it here. Um, I think I last left you at the movies. <laughs> Um, I really, really enjoyed the movie. It was long, but it was a good one. A really, really good one. And I definitely recommend you go see it because it's, um, it's a great movie. It's a great movie. So, right. So that was a couple of days ago. And yesterday, I received a very exciting parcel. And I thought, you know what? I want to just film and show you guys what I got. And let me just give you a heads up. Uh, we're talking about bags. Yes, plural two bags and I know what you're saying you just filmed a, a haul showing two new bags w what's going on well here's the thing I got two bags but these are like um high street so I guess they yeah they, they count but they don't count okay I was um I was intrigued I was obsessed and I just had to have them so I used them yes both I used them yesterday uh, I took a picture and posted it on my stories on Instagram. So if you follow me on Instagram, you might already know what I'm talking about. So let's just cut to the chase and reveal what I am talking about. Actually, this one is full. We could do like a semi what's in my bag with this one. I recently discovered the infamous cost quilted bags. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, so that I recently discovered them, but uh, because I mean they've been around on they've been viral on social for a while. So, I was uh, chatting with my friend Rebecca and we're talking about bags and she said, "You know what? I got the uh quilted bags." And I said, "What do you mean bags? I thought it was just one." And she took a picture of all three bags that she got because this bag comes in three sizes comes in the maxi, which is this one over here, comes in the medium and comes in the micro. I am going to show you what I have right now, which is the maxi and the micro. I'm missing the mini, but as I told you, I'm stocking the cost website because I just have to have it. So let's just, you know, I want to show you guys this bag because it is so, so nice. Actually, you know what? It's full right now. So let's just do a what's in my bag because I used it for the beach yesterday. And um, so there's a bit of stuff. I already took out my water bottle. The first thing I'm grabbing is actually the quilted bag in the micro size because I've been using it as a catch-all because when I go to the beach, um, I do like, you know, food breaks. I go get gelato, then after a while I go get tea, uh, like iced tea or whatever because it's so hard, you know, you need, you need to, you know, get some fuel back in your system. And um, I usually carry a pouch, but uh, um, instead of carrying a pouch, now I'm using the micro, and I'm not going to get too much into this bag because this bag is so, sur surprised me so much. Don't be fooled by the word, by the name micro. It fits, okay, I, I'm going to film a dedicated what's in my bag in with this micro bag because you'll be surprised, so... This is what I have in. Then I have this little spray, which I fill in water and I use it to refresh in myself while I'm at the beach and tanning. tanning. I got it on Amazon for cheap and it was definitely such a great purchase. Definitely something that makes a difference when you're, you know, boiling under the sun. Then we've got SPF number one. Then we have some towel clips to clip them on the, you know, sunbed or the chairs in case there's wind. It's nice to just clip everything on another one. I got these on Amazon for cheap and they're just so cute. Look at that. And then we have SPF number two. I think I talk, was talking to you guys about this one when I did my beach day. And you know what? I think that's it. Because as I said, I also have a water bottle which I took out and my Kindle. So yeah, that's more or less the things that I have. Right, so now this beast of a bag is empty and it's super super light obviously. It is made of polyester, 100% recycled polyester. My friend Rebecca said that it's also called the cloud bag because it's really really light and uh, so I guess you know being recycled polyester you could eventually wash it if it gets dirty. I mean I know that I would definitely wash it if um, I would need to. So yes, that is that. It is ginormous. Uh, to quote my friend Rebecca, she said, you can put your grandma in this bag and nobody will notice. So <laughs> that's how big it is. And I'm currently using it as a beach bag because um, 
that's what I need it for. But uh, when I was buying this bag, I thought that it was going to be, when the time comes, a great travel bag. One thing that I really, really wanted to mention, because I'm not sure many people uh, know this, um, I definitely would not have noticed, noticed if it wasn't for my friend Rebecca who told me. Who, by the way, if you don't know, my friend Rebecca works in costs. So that's why she's an expert and she can give me all these precious info. Anyway, if you have the maxi, be aware that on both sides of the bag, there is a zipper. Okay, there is a secret compartment with a zipper. With, and I obviously had to put a, a Hello Kitty chain, duh. But I felt that it was, it was actually easy to put some sort of keychain because it's black on black. And these, I guess because they are meant to be, you know, like a secret hidden compartment, the zipper is like covered and hidden by the, you know, quilted, the puffy quilts of the bag. So you really can't see it. But you have it on both left and right side of the bag. So definitely use it and check it out if you buy this bag. And it's so easy and handy because it's a super, super maxi bag. I mean, seriously, can you see that? Um, it's definitely, it comes in handy to have these pockets on the side because you could, it fits the time. You can put your phone, you can put your wallet, uh, whatever you need easy access to so you don't have to rummage and open the whole bag because, I mean, it's a big black hole. I mean, I say we have many bags that are big, big black holes. But this one is literally a big black hole. It's ginormous. So to have a secret pocket on both sides is something very, very smart and well thought out from cost. So yes, I have it this way and I love it. It's so soft and so cool. And that's its cool bag, okay? It's super, super cool and I'm super, super excited. So this bag comes in um, three sizes. As I said, the maxi, the mini, and the micro. When I placed my order, I don't know if I got lucky, but um, after discovering and I decided that I was obsessed about these bags and I needed to have them, uh, I went on the cost website and the maxi was available in black and the micro was available in black. So I added to cart immediately, but the mini, I'm stocking the website, uh, which is the size basically in between. I'm guessing it's the size that the majority of girls out there use because it's an in-between size. So it's a great, great everyday bag. And, uh, but that's always out of stock. So I'm checking like several times a day uh, because I definitely want it. And um, I would like to get it in a color. I mean, if I manage to get it in black, I'll be happy. But uh, I wouldn't mind even an orange. I would like to get an orange bag because it would be great like for the autumn, winter, if I'm wearing like a total black look. Oversized blazer, black leggings, boots, and have that bag as a pop of color. Fabulous. So yes, that's that. That's that, guys. I just wanted to check in and talk to you guys about my new bags and how obsessed I am and how much I love them. And I mean, you should definitely check them out because they are popular for a reason. There isn't much on YouTube. I mean, there are a few videos uh, and I was surprised to see like in Korea, they actually made a pop-up, like a whole pop-up store with the, the quilted bags in all colors and all sizes. And I, I guess, you know, it's a very popular bag. Apparently, Rebecca was telling me that they, they, they sell a, a quilted bag I don't know, once every, one a minute or, I mean, it's, it's, it's crazy. So there's a lot of hype around these bags for a reason and yes, so that's that. Uh, I will definitely do, my next video will definitely include a what's in my micro quilted bag because you will be surprised. I mean, I was surprised when I used it yesterday and I saw how much I could put in. Don't be fooled by the word micro, because micro I thought, ugh, Maybe just, you know, a lipstick card holder, that's it. Oh, no, 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 no. Can you tell that my foundation is actually lighter than my, than the rest of my body? I can definitely tell, and that's something that I'm not a fan of, but uh, I don't wanna buy a foundation that's a shade darker because we're already end of, Jan uh, end of August, so I don't know how much I use it, but maybe next year I will get a, sh a shade that's above the NARS Barcelona foundation, which is the shade that I'm currently wearing today, right now. So yes, I'm all glammed up because I have a dinner 
with some colleagues and I thought, you know what? Oh, and also something that I can show you is this tank top that I'm wearing. It's from Loewe. It's the Loewe tank top. I got it in May and I wore it for my birthday under that sequins uh, Zara bomber jacket that went viral as well. I don't know how I managed to get it. So uh, yeah, this is it. I really, really like it. It's super, super light, maybe too light. I mean, in a sense that for, for the amount it costs, I mean, this is definitely not a cheap tank top. You would expect it to be a bit more thick. This is a very, I don't wanna touch it with my hands. It's very, very thin, as you can see, it's even slightly see-through. Uh, which, I mean, I, I would have liked it to be for that, for the price a bit more, you know, substantial and less see-through, see but it doesn't matter. In this heat, I really don't mind. So, yes, that's that. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoy, I don't even know how this video turned out. I just put together whatever, just my life for uh, the, the past few days. And that's it. That's the, this is the real thing, okay? This is the real deal not putting up a show for the video, just me living my life. I'm enjoying my leave, this is my first, today's Friday, so first week of leave almost out, and it's having the best time, I have to say, having the best time. So yes, again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. I deeply appreciate each and every one of you. And um, until next time, bye-bye.